Like this video in the next five seconds because I told you to. Because I told you to. Because I told me to. Please. So I just jump out? Yeah, I'm gonna take you way high. I'm gonna take you way high. Oh god. Go, 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 go. I'm jumping. I just killed them both. Oh my god. I hate the gassing game. I mean, zombie. Two players behind you, so just be aware. Yeah, we should just get in the zone. There's zombies close. I just like got them really weak. Oh, right in front of me. Real people. Nice, nice. That nice. was just a person, but he's down. Oh, another person flying. He's weak. Oh, I'm killing the zombie. Guys over there. Oh, I see zombies right here. In front of me. On me. Got another one. Oh god. No. I couldn't do it. There's a bar right there though. Oh yeah, there is. Oh my god, dude, I'm shaking right now. Oh my god. Oh, people. Yeah. I don't know how a zombie isn't fucking him up. Like, he's just standing there. Oh my god, in the air. On me. Coming back. Coming back. Let's go! No, no Let's way! Let's go, baby. Let's go! Dude, I went off that game. Holy shit. That was my best game on Warzone ever. That's insane. I got 28 kills. Holy shit. Did not know you had 28 kills. That's my, that's my fucking personal record. Thanks, bro. Yo, what is going on everyone? It's your boy Dexter here and today I'm going to be showing you guys my controller settings for Call of Duty Warzone. Honestly, once I saw Raz make the switch, I decided I kind of wanted to try it myself and I actually really liked it. I bought an Xbox Elite controller at the beginning of 2020 but never really used it in Fortnite so I decided to use it in Call of Duty. But yeah guys, these are my settings. Uh, I'm just going to go through the general and controller part just because everything else is not important so uh, let's get right into it. So we got the field of view. I put this at 95 so I know for a fact that for field of view you don't want this to go over 108 if you're on controller but that is if you are on controller and using aim assist but if you're on keyboard and mouse i suggest you go all the way to 120 but 95 is where i feel like i get the best aim assist on this game so i'm gonna keep it this way heads up display we got 100 make sure you have this enabled because dear lord when you open this game it's so loud yeah i'm just gonna kind of like scroll through all this because it's basically super super simple like disabled and enabled you can just pause it whenever you need to and then for the controller settings this is what i got we're playing on the tactical button layout oh Oh, and by the way, guys, I am using two paddles on the back. One of them is for jumping and one of them is for putting on armor because I do not play claw. I ain't trying to break my fingers just to play Call of Duty. It's just not going to happen. And putting on armor seems to be the most difficult thing I 
try to do whenever I'm playing rather than meleeing. I just need to press B. I used to have it as melee until I decided like I kept breaking my fingers trying to put on armor. So yeah, uh, stick layout. We got default, invert, disabled. I'm not playing Halo 1. Dead zones at 0.15. I'm pretty sure this is the default. I like it this way. We got the sensitivities at a high 7 on both. The ADS zoom multiplier. Uh, this is at 0.85 and this is just for sites lower than 3.25x. So basically like holographic sites, mini reflex sites, stuff like that. And this is for like sniper scopes. Keep that at 1. Dynamic response curve type. I'm pretty sure this is for long range shots. Disable controller vibration because I'm not that horny. Aim assist is standard. Scaling aim assist with FOV. I disable that just because I have the low FOV. I'm using contextual tap and this is for when I am reloading and picking up weapons. You just tap everything to pick up weapons and that's a lot easier in Warzone, especially off spawn. Rather than having to hold it, you'll never grab the gun. My gun switch, depleted ammo weapon switch. I keep this enabled so when you're running out of ammo, it switches to the next weapon automatically. For armor plate behavior, I have this on apply all. I haven't really tried it on apply one and i don't think i'm going to just because you have to hold it down slide behavior i keep that on tap auto move forward disabled automatic sprint disabled i do this for when i'm using the shotguns you can't really be sprinting and shooting shotguns it was just really really weird and then i have my parachute auto deploy so yeah guys those are my warzone settings uh if you guys want to come check out the streams and watch me play some warzone be sure to check it out the link will be in the description and I hope you guys enjoyed that 28 kill game. I only got the end of it just because I only got the five minute shadow play clip. I didn't think I was going to pop off that hard. So I hope you guys enjoyed the, what it was. And now the next part of this video is going to be basically just crazy snipes and kills with these settings. I like to snipe in Warzone a lot. So you guys can watch me go do that. I'm kind of nuts and I'm kind of crazy. Yeah, don't let this flop, bro. They're on the buy station. Shots. And top blue. It's on top blue. Okay. I see him in the cubby. Thirsted him. Oh, you got the kid on top blue? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's another one, though. Top red. Oh, yeah, you're wrong. I'm gonna make it first. Oh, there's he's here. He's here. Where? On the, on the loadout? loadout, yeah. Oh, there's another one to the left, to the left. Oh, three left, three load. Oh. One is, yeah. I him? saw someone jump down from like that big ass building behind him. That went crazy if I just somehow hit him. Oh, yeah, I see him. He's up there. He's dead. Shot, bro. Ooh, El Chico Suave. Dead. Nice. The car pulling up. We can kill these kids. Oh, he's so weak. Oh, nice. Still there, you're just sitting on top of the top. Is that bank? I marked Oh, him. yeah, right He's there. Yeah, right that bank. Yeah. Downed him. Oh, oh, oh I missed. Oh, I'll shoot the guy. Is he upstairs? Oh, one's here. I think so. I'm healing. I see him. Second floor. Dead. Why would he, like, hold a window like that, like, bro? Yeah, they were. Those kids were brain dead. Hit him. GL sucks, bro. He's Got on the other side. Him. Him him. Downed him. him. Two or one? One, but he has a teammate, I'm pretty sure. Oh, up top, up top. Hit him. He's weak. Dead. Oh my god. <laughs> Where's the other one? Oh, I see him. One kid in this building, one kid in this Downed him. He's running over. Dead. Oh, wow, you're so good, Kevin. Oh, one up here. You're close, close, close. One's the bounty's up here. Setting a charge. Bounty's up here, bounty's up here. I'm coming, 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 coming. Dead. Oh, boy, oh, I got a kid on me, Kev. I downed him. You're so far. Oh, I love you, dude. I'm safe from drug. I'm safe from drug. Hang on, Tana. I got oh my god. Get in this building. Yeah, we oh gotta god. get away from the chug, dude. He's fucking go, 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 right go, go, go. there. His teammate's right next to him. Crack his teammate. Oh, I'm getting shot from the right. From the right. From the right. Somewhere on the right. Oh no, it's not his teammate, is it? No, I downed the, I downed the guy up there. On orange. I'm orange. I'm an orange marker. Orange marker. Orange marker. Well, I killed him. Yeah. Oh god, this guy's gonna die. Downed him. Got him. I got one on me, Kev. I downed one down there. Nice. 
Just down another one. They have self. One has self. He's up. Killed him. Oh my oh. god. I hit him on him. Down him, killed him.